Bill Colcott, men's head golf coach for Madison College. And, uh, Coach, congratulations. Your team about to uh, take off for upstate New York in the NJCAA Division Three men's golf championships, uh, the national tournament. Uh, first and foremost, how's the team doing? Do they seem ready to compete at the national level this coming week? Well, I feel the guys are ready. Um, we've had uh, over seven months to prepare for this. Our qualifying rounds were, uh, were last October. So uh, we uh, embarked on a plan to, uh, to sort of get ready for this uh, uh, starting last November. Um, we, uh, we had meetings. We uh, agreed that uh, we did uh, uh, work over the winter in terms of uh, their golf swing at a somewhat indoor, uh, indoor facility. Um, some of the guys uh, began doing fitness. A couple of guys are also doing yoga. Um, those things help uh, not only physically but mentally as well. And then when the weather turned nice, uh, we took, uh, uh, you know, t took our games uh, to the golf course and uh, learned not only how to swing a little bit better, but also I began working with them more on how to think around the golf course and uh, managing emotions. So all those things are really coming together nicely uh, to get ready for tournament. Did they get you to do any yoga? Uh, I actually do a lot of yoga. Okay. Yes, I was the one that suggested it for Perfect. some of them. Yeah, I enjoy it a lot. <laughs> Uh, you were able to play a couple of uh, practice rounds against some other area competition here in the spring. What did you see? How did those go? Well, the real intention there was uh, was to, to have our, our practice uh, uh, get us ready for tournament day, that the actual performance uh, or how we did against those teams wasn't as important as getting ready for the actual event, uh, especially uh, the round at Parkside. I wanted the, the team to be uh, aggressive in their play. I wanted them to hit driver and to, to really uh, uh, hit the shot that's called for. That's how I, I describe it. Uh, this is a Donald Ross golf course that we're playing. Uh, he's a pretty well-known designer, and he really puts a, a premium on, on the approach shots and accuracy with shots into the green. So uh, getting uh, as, as close to the green as you can with your approach shot gives you the best chance uh, to make birdie and to score well, and uh, the, the rewards for that will come with low scores whereas uh, missed shots uh, generally are pretty hard to recover from, and uh, that's really what we want. So that's what I mean when uh, I mentioned uh, hit the shot that's called for. It's, uh, it's the, what the designer is trying to get you to do, which is the real test of skill. You were telling us a little bit there about uh, Chautauqua Golf Course in upstate New York. Uh, this is a field, 10 other teams, 35 other individuals that have qualified as well. And, uh, a lot of those teams and individuals have been playing spring golf to qualify. You had mentioned as well that uh, your team, you won the regional back in October. So do you feel at all a disadvantage the fact that your team uh, had such a, a wide length of time between qualifying and the actual tournament compared to others? Well, as I mentioned, we have been preparing. Um, certainly uh, schools from uh, southern climates uh, get, get an earlier start than we do, but uh, I hope we can make up for it with, uh, with, with our good play and, uh, and uh, continue what we did last fall. Bill, well, congratulations again on uh, reaching the national tournament, and good luck in uh, New York this coming week. Thank you.